Hello my dear friend, today I will be teaching you how to use Moodle from the mobile mobile apps. I am Dr. Namaitam Ajit Singh, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Science, Southeast Manipur College. Due to this pandemic and new education and policy, we are supposed to access our uh, educational resources through two modes, one is online and offline. So, Government of Manipur has implemented Moodle for us. So we will use Moodle right now. So first search the Moodle learning uh, LMS learning app. As you can see here this one, we will see whether it is installed in my system. Yeah, it is already installed in my mobile. So I will click open. Now username and password will be coming to you or if you got it, you can assign or if you didn't get, you can ask to your faculty member. From here, I will access my site. So the site name will also be given to you by your faculty member there should be no space okay so same code dot online uac3 dot in then we can log in now i will put the username then i will put the password Now login. Some of the user might be getting to change the password, so you can change the password. Some might not be getting. So if it is come, then you can change the password here. Open the user side. Then here we have we have DM Tungran. So it is asked to change the password. Now I will change the password. First you have to enter your current password. Then you have to change to new password. So I have changed the password. Now sign out everywhere. So let's click this save change. Now continue. Okay. Now I will close here. You can close. You can close here. Okay. Then now reconnect it. Okay. So again, you have to give the new password again. Okay, now we are in the group. Before going this, suppose if you want to change the username and password thing, then you go to below part. Here you have to go. Then from here you can click the website. If you click on the website, it will open the website page. This is actually the website page. You can again log in here. Okay. This is also same. Okay. Here we again ask for this. You can click here or else you can just enter the same password, same username and the password. Okay. Once you log in, you can go here. Here, if you need to again change the password, I click it here. Then we click the preference. If I click the preference, then I can change here the password again. If you require to change the password again, or if you click one to click to change the edit profile, you can change your first name, surname email address okay you can see it here you can put your uh, city or town then you can put your description you can upload your photo here okay for example you can upload this photo here you click this upload a file and you can select for example i will just click my photo okay okay then you can upload this file it may take time from time to time okay the pictures is uploaded okay then upload update profile okay 
now uh, okay the photo is coming in the uh, different direction let's change again okay we can practice no issue we can we can delete this picture we will upload again file upload a file choose a file and we will save the photo as i was so i will click like this okay let's see is uploaded correctly or not okay it's uploaded correctly yes and here is another option optional here you can change the mobile number also don't change this department and everything you just change the mobile number now we click the upload profile okay it's changed now now i will go back to model apps here we are model apps so here you can click the home icon okay once you click the home icon is this student is taking general then uh, botany then zoology and chemistry so we can see here she has taken botany chemistry and english and uh, state also okay she, she has taken the statistics also then zoology also okay okay fine so she has taken like this subject then we can see here also all the courses also this has been assigned to her now if she wants to go and check the uh, botany and there is one option which i would like to tell in here in here which is very important okay this is very important here uh, if you click and you click the show download options so what is good is if you downloaded this and and when you don't have internet you can access it offline so i before downloading i will just go to botany and you can see here this is course is for is mentioned this course is for 2021 and list of the faculties are mentioned syllabus is there contents are there okay they have not yes they have uploaded one uh, paper title so you can see here it is all divided into unit wise and you can see here are some of the content if you click here you can view the file so we click the open the file yes the pdf is open okay so uh, before that we will again see another chemistry also we can see here chemistry and for the chemistry also they have uh, put some topics again we will go to uh, zoology let's see in zoology let's see they have put any content or not yes they have put some contents also okay so pdf everything will be here this you can browse it and from time to time you can see once again i will go for the english let's see is english is put on yeah english we have some topic and everything like that okay so with this uh, you can and here as i have show you how to download if i click here let's say so let's say this uh, botany uh, came as botany we will see botany if you click this cloud uh, cloud button okay this cloud button if you see here here we download it okay it may take time okay so it is asking some data will be used so i say okay let's see how time how much time it takes okay now let's say if i disable my internet and if i want to access this now you can see my mobile is on uh, 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 flight mode i don't have any internet connection not connection so but still i am able to i'm able to access this site i can go with this syllabus i can open this file so this is one of the uh, advantage of using Moodle where those students which have very poor internet connectivity can come to the internet zone where internet is available and they can download those files and use it as a offline. Okay, so this is one of the uh, great. So I'll just on my internet again 
again we are back to online you can see here in below you are back online or offline okay with this again if you want to access the internet through uh, browser not through the mobile that also can be done but uh, best thing is through mobile only because uh, through mobile apps because uh, through mobile apps you can download the content offline but still if you want to access more you can do here same thing same code dot online uac 3 dot in okay so again here we are already login so again you can check all the content also okay you can change the content you can see who are who are the online then you can see uh, the preference you can see and the photo and everything like that okay so this all can be done from your website from this website also once you are done you can click on the log, log out so again i request all the students you can join the telegram here same code telegram in this telegram all the uh, latest update of the college will also will be uploaded from time to time this is the first video for the student and we will be uploading a uh, new video from time to time and there may be assignment quizzes uh, so try to access this space uh, try to access this app and learn it it's very easy like accessing facebook or uh, twitter is same thing like that like playing games so you, you keep on uh, reading all those things and you can know okay so please spread this message to friends of you then moodle is going to be a new learning management system and happy moodling thank you everyone for watching this video